Now, we don't talk about leaks, and we've never talked about new drones coming out that I don't have and stuff, but this I have to talk about because I am actually genuinely excited by this. There's new, there's new images come out for the what looks like to be the Mavic 4 or the Mavic 4 Pro, and I'm genuinely excited. Hi there, Stephen from the Flyby Guys. And yeah, the usual suspects have released the leaked images. Uh, Jasper, Jasper Ellens, or Jasper Ellens, I don't know his, his name, and Igor Bogdanov. The usual on X, make sure you follow them. I'll leave their uh, links in the description below. But they have released this image uh, of two DSLRs strapped together with a Mavic 3 Pro and what looks like to be the Mavic 4 or Mavic 4 Pro. And we have a completely different design on this drone and also the gimbal as well. And the gimbal looks to be way bigger than the Mavic 3 Pro, which tells me that there's going to be a larger sensor on there, which this is why I'm excited, because the larger the sensor, the better the image and the better quality you're going to get. And this is this is genuinely, wow, I'm, I'm, I'm really excited. Now, uh, the design of it actually reminds me very much of the Zenmuse 3 or X3, uh, which was on the Inspire 1 and also the M100. And, and the body design also looks quite unique as well, so not anything similar to what we've seen on the 3, the 2 and also the original Pro. So yeah, something different. There's also looks like there's no um, sensors or uh, obstacle avoidance sensors on the front, but there's looks like to be on the top, which is quite interesting. But good to see that they're having this next to the DSLRs and also the Mavic 3 Pro, which looks like they're doing a comparison for the images, which just shows how good this could well be. Now, when is this going to come out? We don't know, but obviously with the political situation with the CCP uh, and in, in the US, this will probably come out before the end of the year because I can't see this drone coming out afterwards and if a ban comes in, then this would not be sold in the US. I think this would probably come out before the ban comes in and there would be, and the, so therefore you can actually buy it and it won't be affected by the ban. So I think that this will come out in the next few months, probably after the DJI Air 3S, which is supposed to come out very, very soon. But yeah, and, and also we also had FCC filings for the DJI RC Plus 2, which uh, could well be linked to the um, Mavic 4, as we, as we think it is. It, it just seems like good timing. Or are we having a new Matrice coming out? It's also interesting as well. So this DJRC uh, Plus 2, uh, yeah, it, it's, it's, it's quite interesting that this is coming out. Or are we going to get another Matrice as well and that will come out before the end of the year so that this could also be sold because uh, we know that the, um, uh, you know, the M3500 is actually it's, it is a good one as well. So the M350. Uh, yeah, so tell me what you think. Are you, are you excited by this possible Mavic 4, Mavic 4 Pro? Um, yeah, because I am. I'm, I'm really looking forward to it and I'll, I'll be there on day one because I have all the Mavics and Mavic 3 Pro is one of my favourite drones. We have several Mavic 3s here. Uh, flyby guys and uh, yeah it's it's a good workhorse and of course i also do have a uh, mavic 3 enterprise and just thinking about if this goes to the enterprise as well if we get a mavic 4 enterprise i i don't even want to think what that's going to be like because it will just make my work so much more easier and all my clients much more happier anyway we'll see you on the next video like and subscribe and uh, fly safe <laughs>